Maybe I'm Markiplier, maybe I'm not. Well, either way, hello everybody and welcome to Faith, the Unholy Trinity. This is not going to be one of the usual videos where I'm goofy, silly, I play around. I'm in the dark right now and I'm alone playing a horror game, which I expect to be scary. What does this mean? Chapter Marathon Mode? Okay, Chapter 1. New game. Yes. I don't have a... Alright. Alrighty. Here we are. Have you forgotten already? This forest has a mind of its own. If you get lost, you could always try remembering where you've been. Pressing the escape key or start button is a good place to start. Uh, okay. Oh! What? I'm the best. What do I do about that? Do I run? I'm just gonna run forward. Wait, this is different. Wait, what? Oh. Well. Amazing. I sure do love wells. Oh. I guess I'm not gonna do anything about that? Okay. I didn't really want to anyway, so... Good for me, I guess. Oh, hey, it's the deer again. Get back here! I demand it! I will exercise your soul out of your body. Come back! I have to tell you it's Pride Month. Oh, oh. The Martin's house lies about a hundred yards off of Snake Meadow Hill Road. There was almost no driveway. Trees jout, jut out in the middle of a gravel path that is mostly covered in grass. It was difficult to find the house, especially since it was already dark when we arrived. Father Alred seemed to know where he was going. He is simply driven. He see. He simply drove straight ahead until we arrived at the house. In the headlights, I saw an old shed off to the right of the path. Father Alred explained that he would rather perform the exorcism away from the house, but the Martins had insisted that Amy remain inside. He complained that having the family present makes it difficult to proceed with elements of the... of the right that may seem harsh to the lay person. I thought this was about Jesus. What? Oh my god! That scared my... That scared the living soul out of me. Hey. This is my favorite song. Oh. Am I supposed to be dying? Wait. Wait. How did I do that? Whoa. Wait. Oh! If I press space, I take out my cross. There's a deer again. Hey! It's Pride Month! That's not a good reaction. Oh, go away! I have Jesus! That didn't work. Um... What do I do about that? 
I'll beat the Jesus into you. The music's peaceful for what this is. It's n well, it's not necessarily peaceful, but I like it. Oh, purple guy. Uh oh. Take me home. I don't. Oh, I don't want to read this. I should have read it. I should have read it. I regret that. I'm so scared of something being... Why'd the music stop? Why'd the music stop? No, don't do that to me, man. Reading things. I'm looking at things. Woman, I am in your kitchen. What you gonna do? I'll, I'd rather go upstairs. I mean, it's not the best alternative, but... Okay. Man. This is gonna make me not want to play this anymore. I want my music back, please. No. I'm not stepping on those. I feel like they'd make noise. Or something and then something starts chasing me dude I would genuinely cry if something like I guess I was the <sighs> the noise of me picking up the note scared me I guess I was the only one who thought to check in the attic oh god when I got up there it was freezing cold I found Amy standing in the back looking straight at me like I, when I first met her downstairs we spoke briefly, although it was frustrating to talk to her, or it. I experienced a bit of deception from the demon. During our conversation, she uttered my mother's first name and in other instance spoke perfect Latin. I called for help from the others, but nobody came, so I raised my crucifix and began the rite again. I might end this part soon. Water? I'm thirsty. Thirsty? Can I flush the toilet? No. Great. Okay. Awesome. Can I open this door? I've tried it. I suppose not. I gotta go downstairs. Really? Do I really have to? I don't like this. In the slightest. Oh, please, just. No, I gotta go up. I'm going this way. Not like it don't matter. Dude, can you play that pixel music again, please? Oh, this sucks. This is a whole another level of suckery. Oh, splendid, superb. Amy's parents could not endure witnessing the prece proceedings of the right for long. Mrs. Martin was hysterical, and the thing that was inside Amy was feeding off of the fear. Father Albert asked me to take the Martins upstairs. I was physically worn out, but managed to get them back up the stairs into the kitchen. Amy was screaming, Mother, Mother, the whole time. Finally, I got them to sit down with me at the kitchen table. After a few minutes, we couldn't hear much out of anything down in the basement, so I went down to check on things. I found Father Albert lying on his back, unconscious with his arms spread out wide. Amy was not in the chair. Oh! Something tells me that's the chair. Oh, no, 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 stop it. No, why would you ever? He is 
here. She's here? No. I say not. I suggest otherwise. What are th these noises? Oh, it's coming towards me! Um... No, 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 no. I don't know if my crucifix works. No, 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 no. Okay. Nice to meet you, Amy. Okay, okay. I thought that was a jump scare and I died. Maybe. Maybe she's there. Maybe she's here. Yeah, just go in here. Can I go in here? You suck. Man. What do I do about this? Is there something I'm not getting? Yeah, I know. It sucks. What am I... Oh, wait. Okay, hold on. Okay, one of these are gonna attack me. Oh! Oh my god. Oh no. Hard no. I don't think there's anything else here, and I don't know why I'm still in this building. Should I go back to the basement? Um, I didn't mean to do that, if I'm going to be real, but I'll take it. I'm going to check the basement in case I'm missing something, but I don't believe I am. Alright, um, the dark one is you? I- I could not tell the difference. I don't think I was supposed to do that, I think I was just supposed to leave. So you gotta crucify, or no, wrong word, you gotta get rid of the dark one, I think. You're too late. You're too late. What do you mean I'm too late? I'm out. Out of there. Is there an attic? I can't. Stop it, Jeffrey. Oh my god, bruh. I tell this kid every day I don't got no candy and he just... Like, leave me alone, dog. I don't care. I don't know where I'm going. No, like, because this way I'm just going to make myself... My way back to the... I'll just make myself go back to the house. Oh, that's new. Oh, whoa, whoa. Public Lecture by Carl James Osborne. An Etiquette's Historical Connection to Witchcraft, Satanism, and Beast System. Wednesday, 8 p.m. Great.
Okay, what if I do this? Oh. You're invited! Come celebrate Nate and Jason's next birthday! Saturday, May 3rd, 12 p.m. to 4 p.m. Directions, turn right at 1333 Snake Meadow Hill Road and go straight past the well. Can I... Can I... I just tried to exercise a rock. I'm an idiot. Wait, what? I just... Is this a different one? No? I... Didn't I just go here? Now. Oh! The deer! Oh! Whoa. Okay. Poor deer. Yeesh! This guy does not like Pride Mode. Stop! Go away! Did he say worship me? Man... Whoa! He dropped the note? Father Garcia, you are hereby instructed to release Michael Davies from your care and return him to his home immediately. Mr. and Mrs. Davies have already been con pack contacted by our office. A representative of the, of the church is currently en route to their home to discuss compensation in return for their discretion. Discretion. You will meet our representative there and accompany him back to Rome. How do I get out of this? There you go. Y'all didn't see that. This is the thing, it says Chaos Reign Supreme or something? Chaos Reign! Can I, like, can you not? Can I not you? Can you, like, not reign supreme? Was I supposed to do something in the house? I feel like I was supposed to do something in the house. Dead tree. Amazing. I'm a genius. Today I noticed Amy's favorite tree looks like it's dying. All the needles are falling off it and its bark's peeling. I guess I'm more upset about it than Amy is. She's totally absorbed in her volunteer work at the clinic. I guess it's good that she found something she's passionate about, but I've gotten ugly looks from some of the women at the book club. Kathy and her religious friends won't even talk to me anymore. Yeesh. I like to think this game is about turning demons into gays. That's my insight. Oh! I caught some people walking through the woods around the house last week. Not kids, just regular adults. They told me they got lost while hiking. I pointed them back towards the road. The whole thing just didn't feel right. I think I should go dig up Bob's rifle out of the storage. The storage? Mind telling me where that is? A rifle? Gun? I'm just going to keep going up. I'm going to make my way back. Can I exercise the deer? Oh, what if I... I should have exercised... Oh, whoa. This is new. Can I read you? Rest in peace. Um... Oh, wait. There's a lot of souls here. 
Mr. Martin, it has taken longer than expected registering the markers on your property as a historical cemetery. Our office has had difficulty identifying who was buried there. The inscriptions on the gravestones are written in a language that we cannot identify. I've sent the gravestone rubbings to some of the some of my peers at the University of Connecticut. I will reach out to you when I get the response from one from one of them. From them. All the best, Daryl Henderson, State of Connecticut Historical Society. Sounds like a bunch of... Oh wait. What? Oh my god, why would you do that? I am not appreciative of you pushing me back down. There was, there was one door that I didn't get to go in, and I didn't try again, so maybe it's there. Leave me alone, woman. I'll let you know, I'm a Christian. Dude, everything is so scary. Really? 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 Oh, great. Um, you're the dark one. I need, like, this door to open. Um, which one of you is darker? That one. That one. That one. That one. Oh, okay. Well, that's just splendid, I guess. Do I lose all the notes that I got? I don't Do I? You are joking me. Yeah, I know. What does it want me to- Oh! There must be stationed somewhere in the Middle East because he sent over this weird looking doll for Amy's birthday. I'll ask Anish about it next time we have book club. She looks like she could be over from there. From over there. Amy didn't seem excited to see the doll. I think she would rather have a phone instead. Or maybe seeing a baby doll makes her feel self-conscious about working on the clinic. Can I exercise the bed? No. Exercise the rubber duck! It didn't work! It didn't work! Ah! Ah! I did it! Jesus saved me! This is why Jesus is the only true homie. Get away. Can I exercise this? What about your picture? I'm gonna exercise you out of a picture. Oh my god, it worked. I wish I had one of those. Oh, I can probably exercise the picture. Where are you at? Stop it! Oh! That's just great. I suppose. And this? No. Oh, but there's more to do downstairs. Um, can I outrun her? Yeah. Um, I don't know where she's at. Okay, there she is. Um, one of you is gonna be it. I, th I think I can exercise this. Oh, that was not what I had in mind. Dear Amy, thanks for writing. It really brightened my day hearing from you. In your letter, you asked what's the weirdest thing I've seen as a missionary. 
the area we are working on has a lot of folk who practice Quimbaba. Quimbaba. It's what you might call a pagan religion. It's kind of a mix of Catholic and African religions. One of the saints they worship is San Lamorete. Lamurit. Lamurit? I don't know. Or Saint Death. Yesterday we talked to a boy about 15. When we asked him if he had ever prayed, he said no. But I have prayed to San Lamorete. I don't, I don't know how to say that. I'm gonna say it's a muffin. He told us about a time when he stayed over at his cousin's house, and according to him, they prayed to some figures of San La Muffin. And the figures made things in the house move around. He got real quiet and scared looking after that. We told him he could pray to God and that God wouldn't make him feel scared like that. We invited him to church, but he hasn't come yet. I need to wrap this letter up and get back to work. See you in four months. That's kind of scary. Alright, where is she? Where is she? Where are you? There you are. Okay. Um, I'm assuming I can do this. No? One of these gotta be, like... Oh, I know what to do. Okay. Where are you at? Where are you at? Oh, really? It was that easy? With the rifle? Oh. Oh. Oh, no. It's... It's a much worse door that opened. Oh, my God. Oh, yeah, okay. You gotta be kidding me. Let's follow the bloodstained floor. Oh, is this the attic? This is the attic. The church might contact you in a few days to tell you their version of what happened to me. I want you to hear it from me first. A year ago, I was involved in an exorcist of Amy Martin. What they said in the papers about what happened isn't true. She, my su she, she, my superior, father with, with, when I confronted her, she managed to cut the power to the house and her own parents with their own Oh, I have to go back to the house. The nightmares I'm having are real. She's still there, waiting for me. I can still help her. If I don't come back, know that I love you and I'm sorry. John. Isn't that the guy I'm playing? There's a... Ooh, no! Stop! I don't think I want to go in there. Let's go in! I have Jesus... My God, what happened to you? Do you think my face is pretty? Yes. I have to finish what I started. She died, priest. Ah! Jesus! Jesus compels you! No, 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 Jesus says no! Okay, well... Mortis. What, 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 what do I do about it? Too slow! Ah, my Jesus is strong! Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! Okay! Okay! Stop it! Stop it! I can give you a coupon on sales for coupon cucumbers. Ah! Why is there multiple? Stop! I don't like that. No! 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 You know what? I think not. I think otherwise. Oh my God! That scared the ever living crap out of me. Wow! What lovely face you have. Oh. No! 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 Um. You're the dark one! One of you is dark! One of you is dark! Okay. No! Stop it! Okay, I don't think it matters beforehand. I think 
when they dash, you have to like... Do, do I move out the way? You're the dark. Oh, I move out the way, I move out the way. Oh, one of them... Okay, they turn red. Whoa! Okay, you're a fast girl! Nope. Bro, I'm playing Sonic right now. This is like a... Raid boss or something. Major L, Major L. Oh my god! I'm really playing it risky right now. No! Heck, they're saying me! Ugh. <laughs> this, this video is gonna sound so weird. My god! She just doesn't die! Who would have known that exercising demons is pretty hard, I think? My god! Oh my god! He just keeps fighting. Major L. We win every time. <gasps> um, um, no? I say not? Why are you... Okay. Wait, wait. Oh. Jesus moment. You're, you're really speedy, aren't you? This sucks. What can I do about you? I don't like this one. Stop being scary, please. Oh, not she. That thing's supposed to kill me, but I don't think you expect me to be over here. Oh, it's if I'm inside of it. No, that doesn't make sense. I don't... I'm just gonna stay over here, man. Come back, over. I'm not only near you. I'm the best ever. Please tell me there's not more to this, man. Ah! Are you kidding me? Bruh. Why didn't she just do that the whole time? Oh. Kill her. A dog with one bullet. A dog with one bullet. Why would I want to kill her? I was trying to save her. Is that not? This layout is completely different, but okay. How long was I in there? For things to grow this much. One bullet. Okay. Um... I gotta make sure this is lined up. Do I really have to kill her? Well, 
that's kind of harsh. Did I have a choice there? Dang, that was kind of harsh. All right. Oh, I cannot go in there. Okay. Wait, can I? I just heard a noise in my ear that I don't think I like. He came here to finish what he started. I'm not gonna lie to you, this kind of badass. I could have went left or right there, but I'm. I want to go back to my car, please. Can I leave now? Awesome! Oh no! Ending 105. Murderer. Oh, so I did have a choice! You're kidding me! A New York man is in custody after he confessed to the murder of Sterling Girl, who had been missing. John Ward of Palmyra was pulled over on Snake Meadow Hill Road last night after a state trooper reported hearing a gunshot. The officer thought it might be poachers. The officer said Ward was acting nervous and suspicious after being pulled over. When questioned, Ward repeatedly said, I've killed her. According to the police, reported According to the police report, the officer called for backup after Ward became increasingly upset, saying repeatedly that there was a demon inside of her. Ward was taken to Sterling Police Headquarters for further questioning. Ward then confessed to authorities that he shot and killed Amy Martin, a 17-year-old girl who had been missing for nine days after escaping from a mental institution. After a brief search, police located Amy's body in the woods near the now abandoned Martin home. In addition to receiving a gunshot wound to the stomach, Amy showed the injuries, injuries suggesting that she had been thrown out of the second-story window of the house. Yeesh. An officer who helped recover the body told reporters that Amy's face had been mu mutilated in a very brutal manner. Word, Ward was found dressed as a priest when he was pulled over. It is suspected that he has impersonated a priest. He impersonated a priest to gain his victims' trust after Catholic author, uh, after Catholic authorities in Rome confirmed that Ward was not an ordained minister. The rest of the article was missing. Man, that kind of sucks. I wanna. I know this video is long. Okay, yeah, okay. Car. I thought he was like speeding or something. Oh my god! Okay. You shoot the dude. Go to my car. Shoot the dude. Please don't ever take that. Out of here. Get ran over. Dang. 
Easy win. I will say of the war, he is my refuge and my fortress. My God, in him I will trust. I shall not be afraid of the terror in the night, nor the evil that walketh in darkness. Because I have made the Lord my refuge. Because I have set my love upon him, therefore will he deliver me. I shall call upon him and he will answer me. He will be with me in trouble, he will deliver me and honor me. I can't explain what happened at that house. I can only have faith that I did the right thing. Sterling PD is enlisting the help of local animal experts from the University of Connecticut after the remains of an unidentified animal were found near Sterling. The remains of an animal, which some residents are calling a chupacabra, were discovered on Snake Meadow Hill Road by a motorist yesterday. The animal had apparently been struck by a vehicle and parts of its carcass were scattered across the road. Police say they initially investigated the gruesome scene because the motorist who discovered the remains had told them they appeared to be of a person. After, revi after arriving at the scene, police concluded that the remains were of some kind of animal. As a matter of public safety, we want to be sure we want to be sure about what exactly we're dealing with here," said a Sterling police spokesman. This is clearly not a deer or a coyote. If it's a mountain lion or exotic pet that escaped from its owner or an animal with rabies, we need to know about it. Animal experts attached to the investigation would not speculate about what kind of animal had been found, although they commented that the animal was hairless, anemic, and apparently suffered from the rickets a vitamin D deficiency that appears in animals and children who have not received enough sunlight. 